Hello, everybody, all over the world. Hello, welcome to a high announcement, an announcement. I got a very special announcement today because I have kind of sort of been a part of a development process of a new hat. And it's going to be my hat because the guy who made it is a fan of the show. And he was like, dude, he contacted me. He was like, dude, I'm going to make the hat. And I'm like, cool, what hat? And he was like, the high hat. And I immediately went into laughter because that was really, really funny. But basically, there's going to be an update for TF2. Uh, it's going to be focused on music stuff like taunts and whatnot because that's like the thing like you always know that team two fortress two goes in thieves like one period it's like shoes and another is like shades and then it's like gloves or whatever you know that goes in periods so basically there's going to be a music related update you know we've seen some prelude to that with the sniper getting the saxophone taunt we also have the rock star i forget what it's called the taunt but the rock star you know <laughs> engineer has his guitar and uh, yeah, so basically I'm gonna get my very own hat. It's gonna be dedicated to me, similar to the way the crits cast have access to give out uh, low fies. I will be given the privilege of being able to give out this hat as well. And it will be of the same quality. It's gonna be vintage, I believe, uh, during the first batch. And that's uh, why I'm making this announcement because if you want the vintage one of the high hat, uh, you're gonna have to send me an email with your Steam user URL or just Steam username, preferably Steam user URL. Uh, if you don't know how to get it, you just click on your profile and go edit profile and right click and show profile, I think, or something like that. Uh, so yeah, definitely do that and send that to me and I will include you in the list of people that, you know, gets the vintage one. So that's what I wanna give you, my fans on YouTube. Uh, you will be given that hat. I don't think it will be tradable or crackable. Uh, but at least that's what I'm told. So I don't know anything more. I would have. <laughs> I was not giving any leeway to you know, help balance the game or remove the crouch jump jitter or be like, hey, the lock and low, you should fix that. Your Eureka effect sucks. You need to fix panic attack, airstrike, blah, blah, blah. No, none of that. It's like you get to be like the controller of the hi hat, my own hat for the show, which is cool. So yeah. Pretty much that's it. Uh, other than that, I guess I will see you guys in the Man Melter episode because that's going to be the next topic. So, yeah, if you want that uh, sweet vintage hi hat, which hasn't yet been submitted, I think. Don't think it's in the workshop yet. Uh, probably will be soon, uh, right before the launch, I guess, and then implemented uh, from what I've been told. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, send me an email at highgpstf2 at gmail.com. I will also include the, the email below so you can just copy it and be sure to include your Steam user URL so I can find you and give it to you or your Steam ID, like the numbers, anything that can really help identify you. Uh, will I be able to give it out? And I will give it out in a batch and it's only the first batch that's going to be vintage. Yeah. And I don't think I will get the self-made one because I didn't make it, but the creator will. And then I'm going to ask it to give it to me because I'm like, even though you made it, I will make it mine. Anyway, thank you guys for watching and I will see you soon.